I'm here with defensive coordinator for the Hamilton Tiger Cats, Jerry Glanville. Jerry, your team lost against the Calgary Stampeders on Saturday. How would you sum up your team's defensive effort? Well, we had 16 series, and for 13 out of 16, they played tremendous. And unfortunately, uh, we had three series where we should play better. Um, you hope the game's over when there's 13 series. You hope they don't get to 16, but we did. And when that happens, you, you got to still be playing on that 16 series. Moving on to the BC Lions this week, what's your biggest concern with their offense? Well, they they uh, got a quarterback injured, so their new quarterback that comes in there used to be the starter, and he can run and get away. And all defensive coaches like quarterbacks that just sit in the pocket and wait. Uh, so the the biggest concern is. Uh, uh, we'll pressure him and he'll he'll run around and try to keep the play, extend the play. That's what he does good. You're coming from a career in the NFL with foot four down for football to now three down football. What changes did you have to make on defense? Well, I, I treat uh, Canadian football uh, just like American football, other than first downs already gone. So the for the people that watch us, I I treat first down here like second and seven plus in America. I treat second down here like third down if it's third and four, third and five. So I've really thrown out first down football. But I would play on first down in the NFL. We don't play here. You are known for your famous quotes. The most memorable one is when you told the NFL ref who you weren't happy with that NFL stands for not for long. How did you come up with that line? <laughs> I don't know. I never said that in my life until I was so mad. And what happened the week before we were in Colorado, and Johnny Meads, a linebacker, uh, Elway went scrambling, and he didn't want to get a late hit on the quarterback, so he pulled off, and Elway went low and blew his knee and sent my starting uh, linebacker to surgery. So I told the team, even if it's a quarterback, we got to protect ourselves, go after him. So the very next week, uh, the quarterback went on a scramble, we went after him, they called it, and that's how that whole thing happened. <laughs> and uh, I don't know, I just, I was just so upset I was still upset from losing my linebacker from the week before. Well, thanks a lot, Coach. All the best this week. Thank you. You're thank beautiful. You. Oh, thank you.